50% of the people who watch my content are not subscribed. So if you aren't, consider it if you want to see more from me. All right. We actually have another re-returning battle from Reddit versus Robert, which last time I clutched that game. We'll see how it goes this time. Because, like I said, I clutched that game and I really mean it. This is a good team and... Um, Huh. Hmm. Like, what is a good lead for him here? Really, really thinking here. Like, Landris is fine. Um, beat Landris somewhat here. Huh. I'm honest here, I have no idea what to start off with. I think I'll start with Garog. Because if he decides to, like, take the route of, um... Starting with Landers, I think I cannot punish that ish. I think. I think Robert really, really stepped it up. Last time we battled, we, he had a mix of teams. I think he really this time he went hot as OU, and I'm gonna try to match that uh, presence. So, leads off with Landers. Now, there is one thing to keep in mind here. I don't know whether or not this is scarfed. Or um, or whatnot. So I'm not gonna stay in here, but I want to see if it goes directly for an earthquake or set up rocks. Because if it just if it goes for rocks, I know it's not scarf, which means I had the possibility of actually beating him with uh, ice punch. So let's see. What are your play, man? Stuff rocks. So, right. That means it's defensive. Or does it mean it's defensive? It just means. Um, that uh, it's not scarfed. So defog in here, he could always have Stone Edge. Usually they have Earthquake and uh, U-Turn. Possibly um, combination here is knockoff. Yeah, there we go. And the risk with that is that he can be burned. He is Life Orb. Now that's a strat. So now we got him defog, which means that if he decides to stay in, he'll risk of being Connected to a fire blast. He U turns. Getting burned. Getting burned. Got flame body for a reason. Why would you run life or run that set though? That's the question. So let's see. Rodon might actually be a fair switching. Right? Or Tug's effects. And I miss. So Scorching Sands here just to get some damage. Um, I don't win the matchup, I just punish the matchup. Let's see, Scald. How much could that possibly do? Yeah, I did alright. Unfortunately for him, he can't burn me. And he knows that, so I just want to see that he, he he should toxic here or keep scolding. But if he scalds, he's just going to eventually get myself with enough recovery that I can, you know, benefit out. Then again, I'll lose a lot here, don't I? I have nothing on my team that really enjoys taking skulls either. Um, please, Toxic. I need you to do it. <laughs> Damn it, man. Damn it. That should be in red 90s. So, in theory, he wins this matchup, no matter what. I'm just really, really, since I have the flame body and no pressure. I am not stalling out his turns. There we go. I was waiting on that play. So now I can just keep scrolling again. Uh, but now I'm poisoned, which means I'm a timer. But I am at full HP. So I think the good play from his side now would be to... Um, I should again go for Skulls. I'm just going to send in Arixi and go for a Stealth Rocks on my own. I should force him out. 
Damn shame I didn't have something like Taunt. Like that would have been great for this defensive matchup. Which draws? Huh, that's kind of exciting. To Raw Charm. So let's see, if I were him... He's gonna Volt Switch here though. He's gonna absolutely Volt Switch out there. He's not gonna go for Ori. Ori hard switches. Yes! Thunder Wave though, that's not annoying. So let's see. Switch ins. Plenty. Does it have a Thunderbolt switch in, however? Or Lander is an extent. So I'll go for Psychic here, neutral damage. I think he's just gonna go for an overheat. Or switch into something to take the damage. As of right now, he would just want to gauge Electivar. It's not, or Electivar is not necessarily a threat, but since it's a mixed attacker, it's hard to switch into. So, gauging it like this is probably the better overall play. Willow. Nice. So, the good part about that is uh, that I really lost nothing by it. You already know he has dual. Why would you have dual of that? Yep, yeah, keep psyching. I mean, I want to pressure him for overheat, and I'll very much like to take as much damage on him as possible. Overheat, that's going to do a chunk. But like I said, like at this point, I just... I want him out. I want to take as much damage in there as possible. Let's see, the size would draw, I think Ferrafon could come in. Tapple Lele. Ooh! That means I'm gonna get some boosted damage. I mean, it's not phenomenal, but I take it. Bit surprised I actually took that route. Then again, he could be a Salt Fist. That could be a Salt Fist. <laughs> I was like, hmm, why did that didn't do anything? I mean, he's losing nothing by going for... He's not gonna go for out. I gotta send Garug. Psychic is quite easy, I think. He's not gonna go for Focus Blast, that's too risky. Oh my god, he actually did it. Holy shit. And here I was gonna Steel Breaker his shit. I mean, what, what can I say? He got me. Oh my god, that was nasty. Though, excuse me, but I gotta say it, I am actually kind of impressed. That's, um... Yeah, major respect to that, and connecting it too. Ah, <sighs> should just sack play. Didn't win anything by doing that. Right, Thousand Arrows. Bring me the Ferrafon. I have no idea what to do. Oh, that was rough. That was rough. <sighs> this Iron Week is gonna get um, a bit longer than anticipated. <laughs> right, Ferrafon. A thousand arrows should do, I think, one fifth, one fourth, something like that. Yeah, in that area, definitely. So it's probably Rocky Helmet, and this Yara Ball is gonna sting. If he's smart, I think he leads seeds, as he is in a matchup, he just straight up wins. If he wants to. If it Yara Balls, he risk of getting burned. Power Whips, I think, can avoid it. So, switch into this. Picks. Toxipex comes in. Right. Actually, I'll send in Sigurd again. Because I think Toxipex comes in and I think I force it out with a Choice Bandit. 
Or he stays in. I, I don't want to watch this. Get out. Thank you. Picks, picks, picks. That, that's the wrong picks, though. That's a Rotom. However, I think... I think I can knock it out. He's probably, like, thinking the same. Like, is he in range of KOing me? I think we're both gonna feel maybe he sure as hell took the risk. Oh, good, 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 good. All right, so Landorus, life or Landorus? Sounded like a song. Landorus, life or Landorus? Tapu Lele. That's a chunky boy with the golden heart of steel. Let's see. <laughs> so, in theory, I lose. If, um, or Pex wins, I guess you'd say, if I get this wrong. Yeah, I'm sitting in Gable. Basically, take away the terrain. And um, I think I'm rather safe going for close combat. Because I think like Ferrothorn is just very, very nasty for me. Moonlast, good neutral hit, and um, it's gonna do good neutral damage. Yeah, that was a crit. I was like, hmm, okay. I see you. That's the thing though, it doesn't enjoy switching into anything of this. But if I get this wrong, I'm just straight up loose. He would draw us good. Ferrothorn, yes! I'm gonna get so much residual damage on me, but I knock him out. <laughs> um oh no I don't. <laughs> God damn it. Alright, how how bad is it? Iron Barb plus Rocky Helmet is gonna absolutely eat me alive, isn't it? And everything I use is contact, isn't it? With the entire body. Everything I do is with my body. <laughs> alright, alright. Um. Sending in you golf. I know he can't recover. We can spike up, he can thunder wave, he can body press, he can power whip. Jarble, good. Get the flame bottle. Fucking get it. <laughs> Enough already. <laughs> but yeah, if it's worth anything, I think I should probably heavily consider um Oh, he's gonna stack on me. He's gonna stack, I need to attack. Probably went overboard there, I'm thinking about it. Alright, so let's level here. Right now, I can't. If I switch out and he self rocks, it's over. Landorus could in theory kill me, but he needs to set up self rocks. Toxipex loses nothing by coming in and wins the matchup. And right now, he has nothing that recovers. And how Lucha is just waiting to come in and wrap up the game. And I can't do anything for Zao Lucha, I think. Oh, he, he is thinking here. I, I, Robert, do tell me. Please tell me I got you. Somewhat. This is one of those weird situations where I don't mind losing, but I know that if he gets the plays right, there is nothing he can do to hinder losing. I'm going up against a good opponent. I'm kind of intended to <laughs> try to pressure myself. Goes into Lele. 
And the issue with that is that he's just going to get an attack off, and a Psychic Surge should theoretically knock me out. And if I only had a Steel Breaker, I feel so... I feel so dumb losing it. Because if I send an RXC, I just... I lose them on, like that's it. But so is it for most of my mons. I want to avoid being in a dumb situation. So it's like a millionaire here. Basically he won't be able to do anything for me anyway, but at this point, don't know what I could do to prevent it to beating me. Sci shock, yeah, nothing to it. Because I'm pretty sure it is a soul visit. So I'm gonna try to get some chip here. An actual U-turn. Um, hopefully I get him like worried. But Moonblast should do plenty. If Pex comes in, um, then I get some really nice recovery, which is very needed. Just as we draw two ladders. Now, fortunately for me, I don't think Bulo has enough bull to stomach Bulo's hits with life for my mind. That's just impossible. However, I could definitely do some damage here. And um, I'm not too worried if I lose if I lose my choice band, actually. This is something we draw or stays in, so I guess it's going for stealth rock. When it did stomach it, I was kinda of worried about that. Two earthquake, cool. It's gonna do good damage. Yeah, it sure as hell did. Yeah, got him. <laughs> so, I just really hope, since I fell first, I should be able to set the train first. Yeah, so if he brings in Lucha, he's not gonna get uh, his boost this time. No, he got it anyway. Fuck this game. <laughs> oh no, yes! <laughs> yes! And I was just gonna pull the all-time high and just say, nope, you know what? I am grassy seed, bitch. <laughs> Alright. Um, he could still have bravered. Um, I'm, I'm still kind of losing this game, but at least I got one play, right? That's nice. Acrobatics. Half the power. Yeah, that's half the power, right? Oh, only three minutes left? Really? I right, psychic here. Yeah, that's fair. To the le -le. Pretty sure this is a soul twist. Defense drop, come on. Ah. Because he needs to stay in. If he switches out, he loses to Mesprit. Shadow Ball. Ah, he had that. Damn it. Then I'll lose this matchup anyway. Yeah, that's a wrap, actually. I don't think I have anything left to kind of stomach any hits he has on me. Damn it! Shadow Ball, complete set. Like, I was so obsessed of actually trying to be able to stop Lele that I couldn't just stomach the hits I needed to. 
So to my opponent, early mean is fucking GG Roberts. Early mean it. Um, getting that focus blast play on Aggron was actually kind of crucial. Um, not only connecting it, but actually just getting it right because all things considered, I really mean this. Um, look at it from my perspective. Um, if you would have missed that, since I know this was a salt vest, that steel breaker would have ruined your terrain, and I would have done that over and over again. So, yeah, I am ex extremely impressed by this situation. I won't deny it. Um, was there anything else I could have done? Maybe. But, you know, you get one of those plays right, and all of a sudden, I just... I think this is specs, now that I think about it. Isn't it? Yeah, I think it's specs. You know what? Fuck that. Boom. Done. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I still lose, but... Got him. Of course it's specs. I'm being dumb here. So I guess the battle wasn't over. It will be over. But... Um, it will be over because I still can't beat this guy. You know what? Let's get let him. Let's get him. He deserves the KO. He fought a good game. So this is like we're probably about a 20 minute timer. And this is a game that probably could have ended differently. Or could at least be prolonged, depending on that acrobatics hit. Without sword stance and I get more power to me. Who knows? But anyway, Robert. That said, I really mean this, GG. For everybody who's watching this game, thank you for doing just so. You guys are awesome. I really mean that. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Until then, as always, take care, everyone.